stroll walking. I'm just stroll walking. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. Be right there. Oh. How the hell? Came from down there. There. Okay, that's so fucking cool, man. So my hand switching. I fucking love it, bro. I love this game. Let's do only this from Uncharted 3, by the way. Uncharted 3 has a sequence like this. Just so you know. Just so you know, if you're trying to be like, Bioware stole this shit from this other shitty game. They stole this shit from uh, Uncharted 3. Oh man, if the walls are gonna fuck around, I got some shit for them. That looks uncomfortable. No I know that feel. Recent. Fuck you, me, Umber's recent. This guy started a fire since you've been out here. How long have you been out here, bro? How they were just standing in a line right around the corner. What the fuck were they doing there? What the fuck type of animal is that? It's like a rhino. Oh, oh baby, help! Uh, Cass is keeping me warm. This is what we asked them to do. We cannot simply ignore this. We must find a way. And fuck, they let me sleep with my armor on? We need a consensus, so we have nothing. Please, we must use reason. Without the infrastructure of the Inquisition, we're hobbled. I can't come from nowhere. She didn't say it could. Enough! This is getting us nowhere. Well, we're agreed on that much. Shit. 
You need rest. They've been at it for hours. They have that luxury thanks to you. The enemy could not follow, and with time to doubt, we turn to blame. Infighting may threaten as much as this Corypheus. Do we know where Corypheus and his forces are? We are not sure where we are. Which may be why, despite the numbers he still commands, there is no sign of him. That, or you are believed dead. Without Haven, we are thought helpless. Or he girls for another attack. I cannot claim to know the mind of that creature. Only his effect on us. They're arguing about what we do next. I need to be there. Another heated voice won't help. Even yours. Perhaps especially yours. Our leaders struggle because of what we survivors witnessed. We saw our defender stand and fall. And now we have seen him return. The more the enemy is beyond us, the more miraculous your actions appear. And the more our trials seem ordained. That is hard to accept, no? What we have been called to endure. What we, perhaps, must come to believe. I escaped the avalanche, barely, perhaps, but I didn't die. Of course, and the dead cannot return from across the veil. But the people know what they saw, or perhaps what they needed to see. The Maker works both in the moment and in how it is remembered. Can we truly know the heavens are not with us? You saw Corypheus. What do you oh. think of his claims of assaulting the heavens? Scripture says magisters to winter servants of false old gods entered the Fade to reach the Golden City, seat of the Maker. For their crime, they were cast out as darkspawn. Their hubis is why we suffer blight, and why the Maker turned from us. If such is the claim of this Corypheus, he is a monster beyond imagining. All mankind continues to suffer for that sin. If even a shred of it is true, all the more reason Andraste would choose someone to rise against him. Corypheus said he found only corruption and emptiness, nothing golden. If he entered that place, it has changed him without and within. The living are not meant to make that journey. Perhaps these are lies he must tell himself, rather than accept that he earned the scorn of the Maker. I know I could not bear such. I know in my heart that I was meant for this, but that didn't help at Haven. I want to believe Andraste is with me, but doubt is everywhere. Is back because she's still in her move. She couldn't help herself. Kellen's like, I don't know how to sing. See? 
Do I get a sing option? A break dance option? Yes. I am the chosen one. I serve the will of Andraste. I shall defeat the evil dude. No. He's a jerk, but he was also nice sometimes. Wow. Such a picturesque scene. It's a wizard of Grinch. Faith is made stronger by facing doubt. Untested, it is not. A word. Yeah, so let's let's talk. I hope you didn't come to shit on my Andraste Day parade. So all that shit, motherfuckers bowing down and shit. So I said I pissed you off with the whole thing with the Templars, but we're still home, you sure? A wise woman, worth heeding. Her kind understand the moments that unify a cause or fracture it. The orb Corypheus carried, the power he used against you, it is Elf. Corypheus used the orb to open the breach. Unlocking it must have caused the explosion that destroyed the Conclave. I do not yet know how Corypheus survived. Nor am I certain how people will react when they learn of the orb's origin. Alright. What is it and how do you know about it? They were foci, used to channel ancient magics. I have seen such things in the Fade. Old memories of older magic. Corypheus may think it of it. His empire's magic was built on the bones of my people. Knowing or not, he risks our alliance. I cannot allow it. This whole mess is confusing. I can see how elves might be an easy target. History would agree. But there are steps we can take to prevent such a distraction. By attacking the Inquisition, Corinthians Moses changed, changed you. Scout to the north. Be their guide. Then you, I point. You don't see me because I don't have a, a camera, but I'm pointing right now, dramatically, with my left arm, over the horizon. I didn't you point, fool. Place where the Inquisition can build, grow. saying it made me feel uh, like the coolest ever inquisition perks plus one new operations available yup 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 walk around wearing pajamas cuz I can cuz I can cuz I can jealous of my pajamas you better be you should be you are be Look at these clowns. All these motherfuckers are arguing like bitches 20 seconds ago. Now they're all like, oh, we're happy. That's supposed to be a crazy religious order, motherfuckers. You're supposed to be super serious. From every settlement in the region. Skyhold is becoming a pilgrimage. If word has reached these people, it will have reached the Elder One. 
We have the walls and numbers to put up a fight here. But this threat is far beyond the war we anticipated. But we now know what allowed you to stand against Corypheus. What drew him to you? Uh... This all began with Andraste's blessing. It was that simple. Yet did her blessing grant you worthiness? Or was it given because you were already worthy? Your decisions let us heal the sky. Your determination brought us out of Haven. You are the creature's rival because of what you did. And we know it. All of us. The Inquisition requires a leader. The one who has already been leading it. Hmm. I shall take this sword. In with it, I shall slay the enemy. <laughs> Villagers looking up with the wrong colored hair. You saw that shit? He's wearing a wig. You. See it? Tough of brown hair sticking out. I don't want this. I'm a bitch. I have tried to serve faithfully. To understand the burden I was meant to carry. That is always a struggle. You're not sure about this. There's no faith without doubt. Yet I believe this is the only path before us. There would be no Inquisition without you. How it will serve, how you lead, that must be yours to decide. This is true. I am a hero. Give me that steel, whore. This is meant only for the leader of the Inquisitors. Vengeance is what I want, for the lives taken, and the lies spoken. I will not rest until Corypheus pays. Wherever you lead us. Have our people been told? They have, and soon the world. Commander, will they follow? Inquisition, will you follow? Will you follow? Yeah! Will you fight? Yeah! Winner, win! Your heralds, your inquisitor! <sighs> Plunge the sword into the sky, cause I'm fucking a hero, a superhero. <sighs> Badass. Fucking badass shit. Just roll the credits right now, cause nothing will be fucking cooler than that shit. Boom! Yeah, I'm walking around my fucking castle now. Fucking badass. Uh, 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 uh. Strutting about. Strutting about. Strutting about. Uh, rub my butt on the ground like a dog. So excited. So this is where it begins. Okay, well, it's a bit of a. It began <sighs> in the courtyard. This is where we turn that promise into action. But what do we do? We know nothing about this Corypheus except that he wanted your mark. Corypheus wants to restore to Vinter. Is this a prelude to war with the Imperium? I get the feeling we're dealing with extremists, not the vanguard of a true invasion. Tevinter is not the Imperium of a thousand years ago. What Corypheus yearns to restore no longer exists. Though they would shed no tears if the South fell to chaos, I'm certain. Could his dragon really be an archdemon? What would that mean? I mean a blight, it motherfucker. The beginning of another blight. We've we seen no dark spawn other than Corypheus. The shit itself. of shit town. Perhaps it's not an archdemon at all, but something different. Whatever it is, it's dangerous. Commanding such a creature gives Corypheus an advantage we can't ignore. Uh, it's called I kill the motherfucking dragon. That's what it's called. Corypheus it's called that dragon's there for me to fucking sick, slay. But this would make him a god. He is willing to tear this world apart to reach the next. It won't matter if he's wrong. What if he's not wrong? 
If he finds some other way into the Fade. Then he gains the power he seeks, or unleashes catastrophe on us all. You see, that dragon's in the fucking game, so that I can kill a motherfucking dragon at the end of the story. Like, mm, fuck you. And I'm gonna start practicing to kill the fucking dragon by killing all the other bitch ass dragons all over the world. Fuck those dragons. Find me a target. Mm, hot blooded find hero. Find his followers. We can go after them. That's right. We do have one advantage. We know what Corypheus intends to do next. When you were at Therenfall, you uncovered a plot to kill Empress Selene. Imagine the chaos her death would cause. With his army. An army he's growing. The Envy Demon gloated about a massive force of demons. Corypheus could conquer the entire south of Thedas, god or no god. <sighs> I'd feel better if we knew more about what we were dealing with. I know someone who can help with that. Everyone acting all inspirational jogged my memory, so I, I sent a message to an old friend. He's crossed paths with Corypheus before and may know more about what he's doing. He, he can help. I'm always looking for new allies. Introduce me. Introduce me to this asshole called Hawk. Uh, parading around might cause a fuss. It's better for you to meet privately on the battlements. Trust me, it's complicated. Um, well, well, we stand ready to move on both of these concerns. On your order, Inquisitor. Inquisitor. I know one thing. If Varric has brought who I think he has, Cassandra is going to kill him. Oh yeah, where is Cassandra? Cassandra's just fucking off. Where is Cassandra smoking rocks? Inquisition. A dusty old ruin filled with vampire soldiers. If you shut your mouth and open your eyes, You'd see that the Inquisition is our one hope. Our uh, one hope. Well. Hi. Hi. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah! I got the fucking shit. I'm the fucking Inquisitor now. I don't take no shit. I don't take no shit. I don't go fucking slap hawk around. I'm like, Hawk, your fucking game suck dick. Your game was a piece of shit. Your game was a fucking noob. You're a fucking noob. And I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna fucking kill him. No, I'm not gonna do that. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like, in my brain, I'm gonna be like, but my character is gonna be all nice because my character's a bitch. But I'm gonna be like, <laughs> can't see my face, but I'm making a mean face. My mean look, I'm like, stink eye. Stink eye status. Stink eye status. All right. Well, that was fucking awesome. That was the fucking, like, awesomest shit. That was, like, the fucking awesomest shit I ever seen in a Bioware game since at least the last Bioware game that came out. I loved it. It was amazing. It's so cool. <laughs> I'm pumped. And I'm excited. And I will go slap around some fools, begin building up this shitty castle, and I'm gonna go talk to fucking Hawk, I'm gonna go talk to fucking Farrakh, I'm gonna go talk to all the shitty party members I have now, and I'm gonna do the cutscenes, and I'm gonna fucking kiss their asses, and then I'm gonna be all like, blah blah blah, and then we're gonna go fucking do some fetch quests, and all sorts of shit, later, cause right now, I'm gonna go eat food, and I don't know what you're gonna do, you're probably gonna instantly watch the next video, cause to you, you know, that shit's on a playlist, it's just the next one. You don't even have to click anything. If you're on playlist mode, I think it just goes to the next. In either case, I hope you enjoyed watching me being enjoyed by this amazing product from Bioware. All hail. I'm back amongst the faithful. They can do no wrong. They've never done wrong. Retroactively, Dragon Age 2 was the greatest game ever besides this game. In either case, I'll see you soon. I'll see you later. I'll see you then. I'll see you right now.